That sounded real sexy. Yeah. It's all over here fucking opening packs. My cock in my hand. Two cents worth of two cents short of a dollar. I'd never pulled like a featured card, like one of the new cards, out of never, never, dude. I've never been that lucky to pull like one of those feature cards that they feature in the new sets. Never. <coughs> Jesse L. Puig was a diamond. You couldn't get him to pop up the way he pops up now as a shit bronze. Fucking like twenty something packs, almost, almost thirty packs. Bunch of oh, there you go gold. Okay, last pack was got a gold. What's this prospects pack? What it got the future stars in it?
Oh, that's for the Bryce Harper program. Oh, that Bryce fucking Harper program. What up, drag racing? Okay, okay, Ozzy Abergles. I don't have him, thank you. I'll take him. Come on, let me get a fucking diamond, yeah? Baby, a fucking diamond, baby. Let's go. Ooh, he's worth 30,000. Ahmed Rosarios. Ahmed Rosarios. Fuck yeah. Fuck, 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 fuck yeah. The Mets' number one prospect, bro. Fuck yeah, dude. Fuck yeah, dude. Fuck yeah, dude. Fuck yeah, motherfucker. Bang. Dang, thank you, Mountain, for giving me that tip. I sold Joe Nathan, nigga, to get that motherfucker, bro. Fuck yeah. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. I feel so lucky right now. I'm buying me a regular standard pack. Buying a regular standard pack. I feel a Mike motherfucking Trout right here, folks. Mike motherfucking Trout. If I pull, if I pull a silver or better, I'll buy another pack. God damn it, I got a silver, so I guess I gotta keep my word. My last thousand. But tomorrow, folks, we're having a 100k shopping spree, folks. I've never done it before, and we will be doing it. Dude, did I get a gold and a diamond? Oh, it's my fucking night. Miguel know you're about to get sold, chump. Let's go check out this, uh... Damn, I got Chris Sale, too? When did I get Chris Sale? Find out that was my daily login today, bro. Chris motherfucking Cecile. Can you believe that shit, Mountain? Chris motherfucking Cecile. As a fuck... Yeah, come on, man. You know, you know I gotta bullshit that one, bro. That that Johan Moncada is gonna look fucking lovely in that motherfucking lineup, bro. Number one prospect, baby. Oh shit, I backed out. Angel, I forgot to tell you. You, you know how you can take your spasms out? Stick your thumb in your butt. Stick your thumb in your butt. No Vaseline, though, because that's cheating. That's cheating. Angel, come check out. Come check out my stream real quick. I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna show you somebody that's actually gonna start for the first time ever on a Boston team. It's gonna be a New York Met. Angel, you might be fucking glad. Might be real fucking happy. I got Bregman too. Oh yeah, yeah, another pine. Oh yeah, yeah. I have a solid fucking team. I might, I might go play some ranked season with these motherfuckers, man. Go play some ranked season. Yo, man, yo, yo, they can play, dude. Some of these dudes got some fucking. Yo, I got a badass future. I think myself, bro. I just spent low well, shit tomorrow. I might have top of the line future stars. World Series of bust. Right here, this motherfucker is worth. 
28,000, dude. I made it. I. It was just 30,000. I guarantee you when I pulled it, the price just went down. But, yo, he got good contact. He's excellent, excellent player. I'm not selling this fucker. And I'm just going to let you look at this card. He's a hidden machine, speedster, and a thief. So you got to watch out when you invite him over because he will steal your shit and run and get away with it. Now, do these future... No, no, the future stars don't fluctuate. Good, 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 good. Good, good, good. Got a solid fucking team right there. About tomorrow? Guys. I'll be getting these... These right here. These right here. Now, the 150... The hundred and fifty thousand stubs. A hundred and fifty thousand stubs. I'm getting that one right there tomorrow. The fifty normally costs us a hundred. So I'm paying. I'm paying for sixty-seven. I would normally be paying for sixty-seven five, but I'm actually getting like ninety close to 90,000 stubs free with the half price like the $25 one the $20 ones are going for $10 right now so you get $10 you get uh, 24,000 stubs but that's why I was telling you do my map I'm gonna give you that I'll give you the $10 PSN card set it up like the way you did that's why that way you get 24,000 stubs dude they're, they're half price right now. All the stubs are half price. But see, they're slick though, man. They're very slick, but Mountain. Do, have you ever noticed they don't? They didn't cut the prices down on the fucking packs though, right? I see. But if they were smarter, right? They would have did that. People would have bought more stubs to try to get that Mike Trout because there's no Mike Trout in the in the system to buy right now. No Mike Trouts in the system to buy. You can't buy Mike Trout. Yeah, you can't buy him. He's the nobody selling him now. All of a sudden, yeah, yeah, yeah. I got him. I picked him up. I picked him up. I picked him up. Um, Nukem. Yeah. Come on, don't say that, dude. Divas is the only diamond I want, dude. That's the only one I want, man. And I got to rep with my Red Sox. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm going to be playing some Battle Royale to get that motherfucking um, thing. That Andu Benintendi, dude. That card look like fucking. That's another nice card. Missions. Yeah. Oh, but I gotta put these bums in there first. God damn it. Pitcher strikeouts with Minnesota Twins players in one battle royale game. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's fucking nice. That's fucking nice. Thanks a lot, SDS. Really love you too, you cocksucking motherfuckers. But, folks, we're about to get this fucking bullshit Bryce Hopper card. We're about to go get this. Yeah. <laughs> Watch none of them pop up, you know what I mean? Like, the fuck, huh? Oh, I'm not even going. I got like three cards there that on on my dailies. I'm just gonna reroll all of them because I don't need none of them. None of them are gonna leak. None of. 
Yeah, but not a, if it if it's a diamond, I'll do it. But for these bullshit goals, I'm just gonna fucking just keep going, dude. Damn. A and E, what's going on, bro? What's up? How you doing this evening? Oh, good. Yeah, good morning, wherever you are. Um, yep, eleven more hits, and I get a legend pack. That's about it over here, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, 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 um. Let's go check out these these new additions. I, you know, I came across. Oh, doing excellent, doing excellent today. Doing excellent. Now, which which one of these two pitches, Tyler Glass? Uh, one, two, three, four. I gotta put these four bumps in there. But he's going up, and I'm gonna try this picture out. I'm gonna try these future stars out. I like the little art in the background. It's pretty cool. Put Jeff Hoffman in there for these all shit bronze cards. How long did it take you to pop up those fucking shit bums? That wants to complete the fucking the Bryce Harper. No, no, I know that, but I mean, did they fuck? Did the pitches pop up quick? <laughs> yeah, I got lucky, huh? That's what happens when you. I guess that's the reward you get for kneeling down in front of Ramon, huh? Must be fucking great, dude. Motherfucker. Now, where the fuck is he? What, what overall are they? Oh, no, that's not him. That's not him. Jeff Hoffman, let's go pop up. Both of you motherfuckers pop up. Tyler Glass now, where the fuck you guys at? Damn, Blake's now, you're a 76 in the live series. They really got high hopes for you, huh? They got high hopes for him, Mountain. Blake's now, he's out. 87, he's a gold, that's not bad. Where the fuck is this motherfucker at, ah, dude? Pitches for them, right? Uh, they, they make the leaders. Six, line up the pub. Chubby dick, you might have to sit. E Chubby Dick, you can stay in the lineup. We ain't gonna use that future star. That catcher sucks. We'll use this future star here. Let's see. Vision. Shortstop. 
Oh hell, yeah, he's a second base, man. I'm gonna try him out one night. Bregman, welcome to the team, Bregman. And the man of the hour, the shortstop. Ahmed Rosario. Dominican sensation. The only time you ever see a fucking New York Met make my starting lineup. Ooh, Franklin Barretos. I can sit. No, I can't sell you, bro. What other position you play, bro? Play second base. I already got a second base, man. Sure stuff. Third. None of you cocksuckers play first. Let's see. Ooh, Clint Frazier. You're the new left fielder. There you go. from our fucking bitch. Profile plays were fucking short. Angels fan, what up, bro? She might want to rewind about 10 15 minutes back. Watch, enjoy the card opening. Got some nice diamonds. Future star diamond. They're selling for 28 last time I checked. <laughs> you had it paused, oh shit. Oh man, well, who am I looking for? Perfer, just is a perfer. Texas.
Yeah, I'm going to keep him. I'm going to keep him, definitely. Let him go over four. Not gonna let him go over four. Uh, he he just hit a three run bomb, bro. Where the fuck is he now? <laughs> Where the fuck is Justin Purfer, man? Where the fuck is he, bro? Oh, he's a 60 fucking nine. I wonder why I'm over there looking at him. And he's a left fielder. Jesus Christ. Yeah, I got him. I got him. I pu I pulled him from the uh, from the pack. Oh yeah, you're gonna yeah. If um uh, once I finish the Bryce Hop, I'm gonna get um 99 Miggy. So it's like, huh? You can eat it. Yeah, I'm still in the party. I'm still in the party. Come join, brother. There's a few people up in here. I just got them blocked right now. They just don't know how to act when they're in public. One of them is Mr. Quietness. The other one is Super Quiet. Say hello, fellas. Hello. Uh, no problem, brother. You pull two golds, which ones you pull? I'm thinking about selling Jacoby Ellsbury and opening up three more packs. But I can do, I'll open them tomorrow and I'll, I know I'll get the top of the line diamonds. I just know it, I just know it. 
Hunter Renfro. Oh, 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 I thought you were talking about uh, the the rookie packs. That's what it was. I gotta put fucking Joe Mauro in there. Motherfucker. What? 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 A fucking... A, a fucking common? Yeah. Yeah. What is it? Oh. Likes everything. Yeah, uh, I got 436 hundred stubs. Uh, it's really like kicking my ass right now. Bang, got it, got it. Got it, got it, got it, got it. Look at that rotation, man. No, you still got 84,000k, fuck yeah. I would buy the last three you have. I'll buy the last three, leave you at 54,000k. If not, see, I'll buy the last, I'll, I'll even it out to 50k. I'll buy three more future stars, and then I'll buy four single packs. Yeah, I'm about to have like a hundred and something thousand tomorrow. About to get it in. <sighs> you ate it all already? You don't want it? Fucking knock out two of these fuckers, I'll be sweet. Two rice, two hits, man. We are under the lights this evening as we get you set for another edition of baseball on MLB Network. Tonight it's Diamond Dynasty Baseball between the Brewers 
Clayton Richard. Yeah, I'm all on the mound for the Friars. What do you have for us on him, H? Well, Matt, he's got five pitches, and I mean, they're all good. He throws them for strikes, he dominates, he mixes speeds. If I asked him one day, what's your best no, pitch? Because if I want more, I'm going to eat it all. That's fine. Because I'll eat it all. And we are set for baseball Get me a smaller spoon. Because I can't eat it with a big spoon like that. Yeah, I haven't played with him yet. This is my first game, man, Joseph. I've, I've only been home for probably like. Grounded to short. 40 minutes from me. Throw on to first, and one shortstop grounds out to the other, one away. And now we look at the starting lineup for the Yeah, we had to get book certified and all that shit. Evening, we we're going over the books and all that, making sure our physicals are in there. This fuck this fucking process. Because not only for one team, you got to do it for all seven teams. That's when you get ground balls. So you got to go there with a real good game plan of making him get that ball up, which he knows he's not trying to do. It's a tough battle. Watch out with the laptop. First boy. pitch coming. Here it is. Just got a piece of the fastball that time as it's chopped foul at the plate for strike one. Whether or not much nah, you, oh the yeah, yeah, getting the books together is a lot time. of fucking work. It's a pain in the ass, Angels. It's a fucking pain in the ass. Into the wind up. Here comes it's the just my one. buddy's the president of the league, and he's also the head Soft coach. Head I'm out helping short. out, so and that'll be the second out. figured I'll help him out with my with Having our team's third. book. Center fielder, number 77. Stepping up to the plate, number 77. First chance for him here in the top of the first with nobody on. Into the windup and the pitch. Swing and a miss just behind a lively fastball. And there are the umpires assigned to this one. Calling balls and strikes is Mr. Mike Fillmore. Well, Fillmore is the type of umpire. He's going to give you a little in some areas and take away the others. And what I mean by that, he's going to call a little wider on the corners. But up and down, he's going to take that away from you. Throw to first to get him easily, and the side is retired. So a fairly painless top of the first. And now the Padres get their first opportunity in a scoreless ball game. Blake Snell, the southpaw out of the state of Washington, will be the starter. Harold, what do you got? Well, he's got four pitches to work with and uses them all at Leading all up, different Padre. times in the game. So he Center keeps fielder. hitters off balance and gives Manuel you a lot to think about. Margo. Manuel Margot is in to start things off as he looks at a ball to start the inning. 1-0. and oh. Swung on and missed. 1-1. One and one. And he nope. takes ball two, and it's 2-1. Two and one. Wow, that was a decent breaking ball right there, but that's just a pitch that's a little easier to lay off of when you're opposite handed, opposite bat. You can see the sweep of the ball coming right into you. That was a great take. With a moment Not here exactly. in downtown San Diego, a look at the Padres starting what mission lineup. Am I doing? I'm What's doing the, the Bryce Hopper. Tonight, Harold? Matt, have you seen this guy throw? Oh, he is electric. What do you got to do against him? I think you got to attack him early. He's just too I'm just checking out these future styles that I got. He's got one of those great power arms that we'll talk about for years to come. You got to take it to him before he takes it to you. First pitch of the at bat. Corey Spangenberg comes on with one away as he looks Bryce at the Hopper ball. seems it's like one the easiest one to one get me maybe right on. now. Up around the letters with that one for ball two. <coughs> I still haven't even taken a shower. Uh, Three and <coughs> over. Well, that's okay. a good pitch, but you have to get a little bit closer to the plate than that. That's that big <coughs> sweeping slider. If it was a little closer, you might get a swing. And that's finally over for a strike. Called strike two, and now it's full three and two. Ready to deliver the full count pitch. High pop up. And he'll stay with it to put it away as they get their man here for the second out. Batting third. 
first baseman, Will Myers. Here's Will Myers. First cuts for him here with the bases open and two away. Pitch on the way. Look out, a fastball up near his dome, and that'll wake you up a bit. Wow, fastball up and in. I'm yeah. not sure it was intended yeah, to be I just can't that be far up first and that far in, but message sent. Beware. He's ready. Here's the 1 0. Low and away. Swung on and missed. Outclassed by that fastball for a strike. And Dan, that's a pretty good example of why he's such a great pitcher. Yeah, up, stuff. Angel? Stuff is obviously the important key to being dominant Welcome, on the mound. Angel. But it Welcome, doesn't mean a whole lot if you don't have outstanding control to go along with it. Time. But he does, and he really spotted that girl. pitch. Swing and a miss, <laughs> two and two now. That ball's right down the middle, and this guy's hitting in the middle of your order, and he wasn't able to hit it. That's how nasty his slider is. Here it is. You still can't hit it. Here's the pitch on two and two. Got him swinging, and that will end the inning. An inning in the books tonight, still scoreless here on MLB Network. So striding in, Ken Griffey Jr. He'll start things out in the top half of the second. Thank you for the sub, but I haven't received no email, brother. Flipped out the other way towards short. Throw to first will be in time, and there's one gone here to start the second. Time now for a look at the majestic defensive alignment for the Padres. And I'm looking at Will Myers playing first base. Yes, first base. Now, I know he came up as an outfielder. Oh, oh, okay, welcome back, brother. Welcome back. At first base. I love his actions. I love how he moves. And he's pretty graceful over there. We a few future stars out here. And there goes Bregman making his debut. Rounder, Alex Bregman. <coughs> first pitch coming. Here it is. Takes this the other way to right. <coughs> is there two down? He got that one pretty good. It just didn't have the right launch angle to carry over the outfielder's head. Small difference where the ball hit the bat could have made all the difference. In now, Chubby Dick. He swings and grounds it to short. I gotta stop throwing that the first pitch. It's another three pitch inning. Easier than that. A three pitch inning, and the side is retired. Nothing doing here this half. On now to the bottom of the second, and we are tied. Nothing, nothing. Our uh, computer. Ready now, Hunter Renfro. He'll match up with Blake Snell now to lead off the inning. Right fielder, Hunter Renfro. Into the windup and the pitch. And that slider's almost in the dirt. Pretty good pitch and a great take there. There's not a lot you could do with that slider breaking down and unless you can catch it way out front and hook it down the line. You see a lot of swinging misses on those. Here it comes on one and one. The knee buckler, and he swings and misses at it. That's a high strike on a curveball right there. If he continues to throw that pitch, we won't be mentioning his name very much longer in this game. He's going to have to get that ball down to be effective. And a changeup swung on and missed for the first out. All right, here's how the visitors are lining up defensively, courtesy of Majestic. Oh, yeah, the, the first block will come out Monday, fellas, Monday. But this guy um, is. He's got it was raining arm, pretty hot out here today, speed. so I couldn't Love watching him perform couldn't out there film anything. Plus, so we spent we spent half a practice Digging getting our new helmets hitter. for these Young kids. So, as he'll get his first opportunity in this Monday one. will be the first 
first blog post and go ahead Jordan and Tuesday will be the first yeah, time these boys the will hit strike. anybody else besides themselves and the wind up and the Tuesday will be hopefully t Tuesday and will be the first time low, we have our three-headed running back system with with um, our three starting running backs in it because we've only been able to have one at practice the whole and week the until today because one of them the just ball. one of the three was in Florida for a vacation and the other one Whoa, we've been, haven't been able to hold of the, the fucking dad won't answer the fucking phone then when he do fucking answer, he gives some bullshit excuse. There we go, nice start. Throw it a hang at it, man. It's three and two now. Something has to give. Here's the payoff pitch. Very weakly on the ground. That winds up foul. Still looking for our first hit in the ball game. And he looks at one that misses, and that's an excellent job of making his man throw a lot of pitches as he toughs out a walk. Well, he gives up the walk, but that was a really good pitch. Might have been just out of the zone, but not by much. A lot of guys would have gone fishing for that pitch, so sometimes the hitter just outlasts you. Standing in now, Jose Perella, as he will look at a first pitch fastball for ball one. First shot for him here with a runner at first now and one away. And did he go around? No, he did not. Ball two. Check swing on that fastball right there. Looked like he's ready to tomahawk that bad boy, but he's able to hold up. And this one's in the dirt. Come down. Oh, come on. And forget about the double play now as he'll move up to second here on the wild pitch. And he misses again, ball four. And that's back-to-back -back guys now that have reached base via the base on ball. He could get the early hook if he can't be a little bit more precise here. That's walk number two of the inning, and we're only in the second. He's just hit a no doubter. One gone here as he looks at a called strike one. Great job of Who are you playing, um, Angels fan? After the walk. I think he might have let a little frustration out with that pitch. Bottom of the second but yeah, we're going to have an awesome season this year. We got mis mismatches at, at tight end, wide receiver. If this other kid comes back to practice, we Here get a... We probably got like a six foot tall 12 year old kid that weighs like a buck 13. Yeah, he weighs like a buck 13. He's an old delighter at, at his level. And he's a Mitch match. Put him to the wide side of the field. Toss him the ball. Put him at wide receiver. Ain't nobody can fucking catch this kid. You're changing eye levels. That fastball up looks so enticing to hit that you think you see that ball as a hitter do you think you can drive it but it's really hard oh rock oh yeah that's your feelings yeah i figured i'd go with san diego fucking figures they want to play like some fucking real all-stars right now two out and of course here in inning number two and a ball popped foul to the right side out of play yeah yeah, we got a good team. We got a good team, I guess. The you know, they're one kids. Ball. They just got to go out there inside. and well, I know the last do what they're supposed to do. Fundamentals beat talent any day of the week, one. so they got to get the fundamentals 100% correct. Their talent, and if they can get that with their talent, I don't think nobody would. We'll touch Two him in this state. First and second. Can't teach, teach speed, and unless you're an inner city team like how we are, if you're in the suburbs, you're not gonna 
You're not going to keep up with the team speed we got from the offensive line all the way down. Uh, slowest player on the team is probably the quarterback. But he has the most durability and the most strength. He's always the first one to come in from laps, the first one to come in from like wind, st wind sprints. So here's Joe Maurer. He's the number seven hitter, but he's leading, leading off the Boston. third after the first six guys in the lineup. Uh, tight end is the most aggressive offensive lineman we've got. He probably weighs he really in. 100 pounds soaking wet. And this is hauled in on the run for the out. And he had a lot of ground to cover to get to that one. Our center, I think, is like nine years old. Weighs 125. In, number one. Batting from the right side with the southpaw on the mound. First pitch of the at bat on its way. Swinging a ball hit on the ground, no. but a foul ball here. 0 and 1. Well, he can weigh up to 135 pounds, so. The wind up and the old the kids we got. I gotta keep an eye on the 12 year old. They can't weigh more than 110. Margo on his horse. Makes the play, <coughs> and there are two gone now. Batting ninth. Now at the plate, Blake, Blake Snell. His guy's still looking at a zero in the hit column. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Late that time for a strike. I think he just subscribed to the swing hard in case you hit it philosophy of hitting. As a pitcher, why not? Better than standing up Some there lights. like you've never held a bat before. This is flared out towards second. Hmm, the pitch to get the base he can't get there, and it's into center field. Who would have thought it, Matt? Eight up, eight down, and you give up the first base hit no, to the other pitcher. Baseball can be a weird nice sport. Little jump. Here's the pitch. Stepping in Come now, on, uh, number Matt Rosario. one, as he looks you, at a fastball that misses let's off the see what plate you're all for ball one. Hold on, Second hold on, hold on. Are you guys, SDS, are you fucking shitting me? You have these future stars in here, and you got a 91 diamond overall. And you don't even say his fucking name. You don't give him the respect to s announce his fucking name. You just say, number one, up to bat. You're a fucking disgrace. Yes, you can get some some flower seeds. Yeah. Ramon Russell, your developers are a bunch of fucking assholes. They disgrace this game with this bullshit of not having the fucking players' names in there. Future stars. That you see that second fucking word, stars. When a star comes up to bat, King Griffey Jr. They don't say, oh, 24. Fucking here, cocksucker. He out to start the ball game. He's already 0 for 1. He's already starting to piss me off anyway. So if he don't hit a shot here or a gapper, he might be on the cell block. Ah, mad fucking Rosario. The 91 fucking future star that just first. popped Spanger up behind first base. So no runs 0 for here on 2, a base hit. Mountain no errors and one man left aboard. We'll head now to the home half of inning number three. And we are tied nothing nothing. So striding forward now, Clayton Leading Richard. He'll look to get something going Richard. here in this scoreless Clayton. ball game. Richard. And a high strike to begin the at bat. It's 0-1. On its way, the 0-1 pitch. And a neck-high fastball that time. One and one, here it comes. You got this shit bum's name in the game, Clayton Richards. Well, he doubled up on that slider, so that tells me he's really feeling it at this point in the game. Good chance we'll see a heavy dose of that slider as this start continues. Bad call, huh? That was a bad fucking call, huh? 
That was a Here bad call. That was a mistake. So we called it a ball. Um, and this is swung check. on and missed. Five quick Get strikeouts. Get your Benny Boone glasses checked, bro. Inning. Really impressive pitching right there. Center Sometimes as a pitcher, seven. you can get frustrated and when well, you make a good pitch and you don't get that call from the umpire. But what does he do? He comes back with a good pitch and gets the strike. Manuel Margot is at the plate now and he takes a cold strike. He's ready. Here's yeah, the Benny Boone. The Benny Boone glass. Laid off as it caught the inside Motherfucker, corner. you He's just really said, damn, these, 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 these glasses the can't even keep a mosquito out swing. my fucking and eyes. Now, they just grind out the AB. Well, the same shit, but the same shit. Nothing you know, you, you know what I mean, bro. You, you know what the fuck I mean, bro. And he misses there, one and two. You know what the fuck I was talking about, man. Set to deal on a ball and two strikes. On the ground Ooh, up the middle, rained in. Bad and fucking oh, motherfucker, I'm mad. And you, and you have a throwing error. Got to go. All right, flat 400. Welcome for stop. Thank you for stopping by, brother. Thank you for stopping by. Make sure you hit that like button before you leave. Stepping into the box, Corey Spangenberg. 0 for 1 here in the early going. He's ready. Here's the first offering. And that changeup makes him jump, a swing and a miss. Give well, it a thumbs up. Change up. But right there, I liked it. He got out front of the swing, and now you got a strike. Now the 0 1. And a slider bounces, and that gets away. <sighs> and forget about the double play now as he'll move up to second here on the wild pitch. Well, the graphic here isn't going to properly show just how far that pitch was from the strike zone. That thing wasn't even close, and I think it made the decision to move up a base pretty easy to make. Swing and a miss on the fastball, and it's one and two. Well, I think his eyes lit up when he saw that pitch coming up at his eye level. Yeah, good luck. But hey, a high fastball all of a sudden becomes really dangerous for a pitcher if it's not spotted above the zone. A little height difference makes all the difference. That's probably not what he wants to do with two strikes right there with the fastball. He is fortunate he just fouled it off. And a swing and a miss and another punch out here. Six already. Oh, and that's out number two. First baseman. Digging in for his second at bat. Myers. Will Myers. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. Breaking pitch and this bounces in front of the catcher. Myers awaiting the 1-0. Hey. The high fastball is in there. Well, I like that, taking that strike right there. Look, he's already walked a couple guys early. He's not throwing the ball consistently in the zone. You have to be patient and make him work. In the dirt here, runner holds as the count moves to 2-1. and one. Fastball, and mm, looks like they're pinching him a bit here. It's 3-1. 3-1 count to this guy? You don't want to challenge him right here. Don't give him anything to hit. No, no, no. Keep it on the corner. Takes a look at a strike over the inside corner. A lot of times you see guys in the middle of the order get worked away, but not right here. They're keeping it inside on him. And he struck him out. His seventh of the ball game, and that ends the inning. Goes One hit. Off. This is gonna have to be the first and only game tonight. Here's Jerickson Profar. He'll start Come on, Jerickson Profar. Fucking hit a fucking bomb. Bring on its way. Chopped weakly to the left. To first That's a fucking time. bomb he hit, bro. Point. That was a bomb. You seen that bomb he hit, Angels fan? So that was a fucking. He dribbled it right over the fucking the third base. For the two starters. And both of these guys bringing it pretty good. 97 and 93. Now, is I the haven't top seen Blake Snell so touch far. 97 yet. Cock sucking liars. Stepping in and ready for another shot. Number 77. He's 0 for 1 thus far. First pitch hack in here, and that's the first strike. Well, if you love pitching and defense, this has been and a game for you. And a guy that's been in the league for over a month that, now, Clint oh, Frazier. You know, Matt, His name so doesn't get announced up to that in the 77. And 9 to 8, it's nice to see a low-scoring pitcher's duel for once. Hit to short. Oh, he makes the stop. The throw to first. Just late. He's safe. Nearly up. 
Murphy Jr. Come over here, boys. Oh, holy shit. Into the box now. Ken Griffey Jr. And they pitch out here, but nothing's going on. Yeah, they do make some excellent plays. Hard hit ball to second. And a base hit there is Junior's aboard. And that runner will go no further than second as there are two aboard now. Well, that's a tough one right there. If that ball's at somebody, probably a double play. But as a result, it's one of those seeing eye singles just found the hole. In now, Alex Bregman. He goes the other way as this is hit in the air toward the gap in right center. And he's going to get there after a long run as he gloves it for the second out. And he'll make it up to third on the fly ball as he's in there now with two away. Ready for another chance. Chubby Dick. Two men on, two away here in the fourth. Chubby Dick up to that. He's set. Here it comes. Runner goes for second. Pitch is high. Griffey can't steal and bases, he'll be man. tagged Griffey out at sucks. second base. Trying to get into scoring position. Last time I ever played Griffey, I, st I mean, so I no steal with Griffey. On two angle. hits, no errors. Her me, Pilly Mama. That base. motherfucker the sucks stealing bases. Four, we... Hope that 99 ain't like that. In Pilly Mama. Again. I'm about to get that 99 Griffey after this game, girl. Here. Into the wind -up Hunter, and the run throw. Strike out like you do. Just a bit high. The wind up and the 1 0 pitch. High in the air out to center field. Number 77 is there and he makes the catch for the out. Now batting, third baseman, John Hervis Solarte. Striding into the box, Yon Hervis Solarte. He drew a walk his first time up. Hot shot to third. Bregman fields it cleanly. Throw to first will get him. Already two away here in the home fourth. The batter number two, shortstop, Jose Parilla. Digging in to try it again. Jose Parilla reached base via the walk in his first plate appearance. Yeah, what is this, this game? Oh, it's Line drive deep, to left. Good, yeah. And that'll get down for a two-out single. So we'll go a little deeper into the bottom of the fourth as that extends the inning. Not in time, and he's in there with a double. Yeah, this one was starting to look like it was going to be one now of those batting. one, two, three left easy fielder. innings. But now all of a sudden, they have the go-ahead run standing out there at second base after the two-out double. Big moment here. Standing in now, Carlos Oswahe. Ooh, he saws it off with that one. A scoop with the bare hand. Not in time. Nearly a remarkable play, but score at a base hit, and the inning continues with two away. Into the box, Austin Hedges. Now a swing, and he pops it foul behind the plate. Dick is there, and he puts this one away for the third out. So a great job there of working out a potential trouble. So it's no runs on two hits, no air. So stepping in, Chubby Dick. Off He'll start Boston. things out as we begin Catherine. the fifth. Chubby Dick. Into the windup and the pitch. This one is launched. Look at this. And it's way up there to the top of the Western Metal Building. So a solo shot down the line in left. As they get on the board first, it's one to nothing. 
Well, when you groove the first pitch a strike, these hitters are going to make you pay. Something tells me I don't have to tell the guy in the mound that anymore. That hurts. So here's Joe Maurer. Joe Maurer. And he'll quickly send a line drive to center field. A dive, but it'll get past him out in center, and this could roll till tomorrow. Now Maurer's going to try to leg out three. And he will make it all the way to third now, as that mistake proves a costly one indeed. Hey, even the best no center fielders make mistakes once in a while, and that's definitely the case here. He totally misplays it, and by the time he recovers, no chance of keeping him from ending up at third. Into the box now, number one. And he puts it on the ground to second, fielded by Spangenberg. Only play is going to be to first, so score it as an RBI ground out as the lead moves to two to nothing now. Digging in, Blake Snell, one for one after a single his first time up. Swing and a miss way behind the big fastball. Faces are empty, one man out. This is swung on and lifted down the left field line, but it'll get back into the crowd as he jumps ahead of him now, 0-2. And a minimum effort at bat that time as the pitch is taken for a strike three called, and he'll go back to focusing on pitching instead. Two away now. Number one. Ready for another shot now. Number one. 0 for 2 on his line thus far. Eight. And he gets ahead 0 and 1. The 0 1 on its way. Mm -hmm hit the other way out toward right field. We'll reach out with one hand to make the catch on the move, and that ends the inning. So they get a couple of runs on two hits, no errors, no and no one beat. left aboard. Coming to the plate now, Pitcher. Clayton Richard. Clayton. 0 for 1 for Richard. him here in this one. A little late on this one as it's lifted the other way down the left field line. Profar will get there with ease as he puts it away for round Center number field, one. Number seven. Manuel and that'll bring up Manuel Margo. Margo. One for two on his line so far in the game. Zero. And he throws the fastball by him here. 0-1. Oh they can't afford to continue to fall back any further. They got to get something going on the offensive side. Somebody's got to step up, give a big hit, maybe even a home run, drop a bunt, do something. But this offense has to get going. Well, Matt, they've all seen him at this point, and clearly they're not picking him up much better. Do you see the swing on that pitch right there? Nasty. And he struck him out. Good pitch there as he registers his eighth punch out of the ball game. Well, he's really locked in at this point 15, in the game on the bump. Baseman, so far this inning, Corey four pitches and two outs. Got the first guy on one pitch, then absolutely dominates this at bat with a three-pitch strikeout. He's ready. Here's the first offering. Grounded foul. He did a nice job of getting two outs before the two-hitter came to the plate. Now you got the two-hitter at the plate, and you start to move to the power. You want to keep as many of those little guys out front off the base before the big boys come up. No runs, three hits. No errors in the ballgame for the Padres. And this pitch is up and in as he backs away. It's ball one. Still a little bit early to be worrying about this, but in a two-run game, a two-out walk right here could at least get the tying run to the plate. And on top of that, there's some pop on that on-deck circle. Chop foul over towards the coaching box. Oh, he's going to want that pitch again. That ball's right down the middle in his wheelhouse. His eyes lit up. He just didn't let it travel deep enough or he could square it and keep it fair. And the slider's in the dirt as he lays off it for a ball. 
even at two balls and two strikes. Here's the pitch. Chopped foul over towards the dugout. Oh, that's one he's going to want back right there. A fastball right in your wheelhouse, and you foul it off. And he's got himself another one as he picks up strikeout number nine here, and the side is retired. So they go quietly here in this half inning. We're through. Ready for another chance? Jurickson Profar. He'll try and get things started as we begin inning number six. Profar. Here's a fastball chopped foul at the plate at strike one. The wind up and the 0-1. Hit out towards second. Spangenberg has it. Throw to first gets him, so the leadoff man's retired here to begin the sixth. Now batting, number 77. Stepping in and ready for another shot, number 77. He singled in two trips to the plate thus far. At the knees, strike one. Well, it's been a good outing so far, but he hasn't really racked up the strikeout totals that you might think, Dan. Yeah, but for him, Matt, he's more of a pitch-to-contact kind of guy, and obviously it's working so far, and the way he pitches, it really keeps his pitch count down. But this will hang just long enough for him to run it down in shallow right for the second out. It's got like double-barreled action now in the San Diego bullpen as they get a lefty and a right-hander up the throw. Ken Griffey Jr. is in with two away now as he looks at a called strike one. When you're facing this good a hitter, man, that strike one becomes so important to get ahead with him and make him think about something else. Now you can control the bat. In there, and he's ahead 0-2 now. Hmm. Bases are empty here with two men out. Good job to spoil that one away, and he stays alive. Ready with another 0-2. He pulls this one into right, and that's in there. So hey, perhaps here some here life here with two men out. Two out hit, that'll bring Alex Bregman, to, Alex Bregman to the plate as well. To the this guy's such a good hitter. Two. I get the feeling, even when he's down 0-2 in the count like he was here, he's still actually ahead of the count when he's facing anybody. And that'll bring up the former first rounder, Alex Bregman. There's oh, a swing Bregman and a missile sent out to center yeah, field, but missile. not quite enough as it's off the center field wall. So now they'll have two men in scoring position following the two out double. Any hitter will tell you that a shot like that just feels it? different. It Captain. sounds different off the w bat. See his six. arms get extended, right arm tucked up against his body barrel the bat all over the ball and he smokes it right off the wall at left center. A little more hang time and that one probably gets out of here. Chubby Dick will stand in yet again as we flash you back to the middle innings. This was a turning point here. A solo home run that was really one of the key at bats of the ball game to this point. And ball four here on the intentional walk so now they'll have a force at any base with two gone. Now batting first baseman. Joe Mauer. Now the skipper of the Padres is up out of the dugout on his way to the mound. And Padres. that is going to be all now Number for Clayton 76. Richard. Jose Torres Jose. answers the call to pitch here in a big spot. He inherits a bases loaded jam but needs just one out to get out of it. Back up the middle. And that is in the center field as he comes through. It's a base hit. One run scores. And the second run will score. It's now a 4-0 game. Ready once again, number one. He's got an RBI despite an 0-for-2 effort to this point. Hoping to limit the damage, here's the pitch. Fastball in there for a called strike. On its way, the 0-1 pitch. Now a swing and a hard hit grounder, but this will wind up a foul ball, strike two. Action now in the Padre bullpen as it looks like a right-hander's game. No, no, I'm not in just, I'm just messing around with um, 
with Pilly Mama. The O2 Angel. Pitch. High fly ball after yeah, straightaway nice center. Right Margo's under it. And the inning is over. I'm fucking tired. I, I can so barely it's two runs my eyes open on three hits. Right no I errors. Just don't, don't and a couple of men left. Here's right Will now, Myers. But. And through five Turn turns at bat, they've only mustered a total of three hits. Not Whoa. terrible, but they're certainly not firing on all cylinders. Well, it's getting a little bit too late in this game that this continues like this. In today's game, with so many dominant bullpen arms, you certainly don't want to wait until the eighth or ninth to try to wake the bats up. Set to deliver on nothing in two. Here it comes. And he just misses with a curveball. Well, this is an approach we've seen him use effectively lately. Set up the inside and then get him out with pitches away. And he'll try to get him fishing there, but he won't offer in the dirt, and it's back to even at two and two. Tell you what, his spot has been the outside pitch right there, and now we're late in the game, and he continues to pound the outside pitch, and it's really working out for him. So it was a swinging well, strike right three. Will Myers is retired, leading off the bottom of the sixth. Hunter Renfro stands in for the third time now as he takes a look at a ball. It's 1-0. and He's obviously been very impressive on the mound in this one. And I think the big reason why is his ability to stay out of the middle of the zone. That's kind of obvious, but it's clear to me that even when he misses his spots, he's not missing over the plate. Let's it fly 2-0, but this one's by him for the first strike. Two and one on its way. Swing and a miss way behind the big fastball. No runs, three hits. No errors in the ballgame for the Padres. This is hit high in the air and pretty deep down the left field line. And he will run this one down. A good read off the bat for the second out. Now batting third baseman, John Harvis Solarte. Digging in to try it again. Yon Herba Solarte. He's 0 for 1 thus far. And a fastball close, but ultimately ruled a ball 1 and 0. Matt, this is one of those games that has that guy right there, his head scratching. He's trying to figure out how do I get these guys going. We may see a team meeting to motivate them a little bit better. And now a curveball that's low and in the dirt for a ball. It's 2 and 1. Three and one. Well, he falls behind three one right now, but man, he's really throwing the ball well. He's been attacking them all game. And that misses for ball four, and the Flyers are going to have themselves a two out base runner. Oh, Digging in and looking two. for more, Short Jose stop. Perella. Man oh, at first hey. after the two out walk. He comes set. Here's the nothing and nothing pitch. A fastball right down the middle for a strike. Oh, that's for sure going to be a pitch he wants back. You're not going to get many balls right in the wheelhouse from a top-level arm like this. On its way, the 0-1 pitch. In the dirt. And he is safe at second, and the wild pitch here could prove costly with two away. Runner in scoring position at second with two down. A swing and a shot hit down the corner. And that'll get down out there for extra bases. And they'll get back the run here as they're on the board. It's 4-1. to one. Lachey's are around for a reason. And that hit right there is a reason they say baseball is a game of inches, right? Just barely fair, but that's not much consolation for the guy standing on the mound. Nice RBI two-bagger. Carlos Asuaje is in with two away as he takes a ball, 1-0. Two out here and a runner at second. He swings at the fastball here and lifts it into the air to shallow center. And that's going to fall for a base hit. And that'll score the runner from second as the lead is cut to 4-2 now. Riding in once again, Austin Hedges. Trying to keep things going now with a runner at first following the RBI single. Now time is called, and this might be to buy a little time for that reliever to get loose. 
Skipper out of the dugout, making the slow trek to the mound. And he's going to motion for his bullpen here. That'll do it for the starter tonight. Look out, a fastball up near his dome, and that'll wake you up a bit. Whoa, that, that'll get your attention. First pitch out of the bullpen, and it's a fastball inside, nearly hits the batter. Everybody's on edge right now. Fastball got him to swing through it. It's one and one. That's a big fastball, obviously, and we're going to see this reliever throw it a lot. drive to left and that's in there base hit Oswahe is on his way home and they're making to get him as he's in there to score back to back fastballs he blew the first one by him and said here we go try it again he said come on bring it I'm ready and he timed it perfectly number 17 will look to provide a little two-out thunder off the bench as he'll hit with a runner at second and two away. And that one right down Main Street. Well, this is kind of the life of a pinch hitter. You maybe get one at bat a game, and it usually comes against a relief pitcher that's absolutely throwing bullets at you. And he takes strike two. He certainly hasn't been the aggressor in this at bat. Two straight takes, so now we'll see if he can change his approach and battle up. And this ball's chopped foul at the plate, and that'll hold the count at 0-2. Well, I think he's trying to get that two-strike fastball out of the zone. Just caught too much of the plate right there. Fortunately, he fouled it off instead of putting it in the seats. And he's going to make it up to third here as he advances on the wild pitch. That can be a tough read as a runner on second to see if the ball has gotten away enough to move to third. You have to be sure you can make it. He was there, and now he's only 90 feet away. Trying to hold the lead. Here's the delivery. And he strikes him out here, so he's able to stop the bleeding a bit as this side is retired. So three runs on three hits, no errors, and a man left. We're through six full. Boston is on top here, four to three. Back here at Petco Park. We're off to the seventh inning now, but first let's have a look at our game summary to see how we got here. Kirby Yates Kirby. is on the pitch from the bullpen now to start inning number seven. Stepping into the box, like that, Roberto Ozuna. Tomorrow, fellas, I don't fucking be through. I'm beat, I'm beat, I'm beat. 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 I